In these tight financial times, it's safe to say that many of us are looking for ways to get more money. So today we're talking with a financial expert who says he can help you find your hidden cash. In fact, he says just making small changes to the way you manage your money can bring big results to your financial future. Joining us to talk about Cash Map is Dennis Williams, the creator of this program. Good morning. Good morning. So good to be here. Oh, I'm thrilled you're here because I love hearing about anything that can help me, you know, just keep my money conservative and make more money, right? That's it. All right. So tell me about what is Cash Map. Never heard of it. Cash Map is an interactive educational financial application built on the iPad. Okay. Okay. And, and what it does is just really simple. It, it takes a couple of financial concepts, teaches you what they are, then asks you a few simple questions, and then shows you how much money you could save off of any loan that you have, when you'll be able to pay it off, how much earlier, okay. and how much money you can have in savings in 15 years. Okay, you've got my interest here. Okay. So it, it kind of sounds a little bit like a secret financial formula. Actually, it's not. Banks have been offering this particular strategy to their big corporate customers for years. Okay. And it's really just simple math. They've been doing it, but we just haven't known about it. All right, so how does it work? We all know the, the approach of leaving our money sitting in a checking account and that we learn nothing. We, we earn nothing. Okay, we, nowadays we earn Not, nothing. That's right. Right. Instead, what we teach you is to use a line of credit. Shift your income into the line of credit. Mm. I've never done that. Never done that before. That's a little risky for me, but let's keep on talking about okay. this. And then you're also going to follow the concept of holding on to your money as long as possible. Okay. Okay. So if you have a mortgage that might be due on the first, you're going to use the grace period. You're going to take your other expenses and pay them later in the month. And by doing that, you end up paying less interest. And the less you pay in interest, the, the more, more goes to principal. So you can pay off loans early, and loans paid off early means more in savings. Okay, so what are the requirements to make to making Cash Map work for you? Because it has to be individual, I'm sure. It's just two requirements. Two requirements, okay. The first one is you need to have a line of credit, and it could be a home equity line of credit, a personal credit line, or a credit card. Second, you have to maintain positive cash flow. If you're living paycheck to paycheck, this is not a strategy that you should do. Okay. Okay. So you need to have at least some reserve, if you will? That's right, and you want to have that anyway because experts tell us we need to have three to six months, ideally, in case of an emergency. Okay, now earlier you mentioned that the line of credit to pay debt. Explain that one to me because okay. when I hear line of credit, I kind of shy away from that. Sure, and you shy away from it because of the wrong way that we've been taught to use it. Okay. Okay. I want to emphasize again that Cash Map shows you exactly what to do and when to do it. Step by step. Step by step. Very important. Okay? Okay. So to put the whole process together, what you're going to do is you're going to shift your income into the line of credit. And then what you're going to do is from within the line of credit, you are going to pay your bills. You write a check, the dollars come out of the line of credit, and out it goes to pay your bills. It's just that simple. That's all you're doing. Now, give me an example because I think everybody out there would love to pay off their mortgage faster, including me. How can I pay off my mortgage faster by using this program? Okay, there's one piece I didn't tell you. When you start the process, once you have those first couple of steps set up, you are going to take a withdrawal from the line of credit that's five times those, that positive cash flow and make an additional payment to that loan. Okay. Okay? And when you do that, you're now using the line of credit as a cheaper source of interest, and that's what helps you pay it off faster. A woman of numbers, and I'd like to know exactly what somebody may have per month. So give me an example so I can visualize this. Okay. Let's take Susie. Okay, Susie. Okay. Susie. Susie. She has income of $5,750 that she puts in the bank every month. Oh, that's good. That's good. That's a nice income. And she has expenses of $4,750. Okay, so, so she has an extra $1,000. $1, ding, ding. That's her, that's her positive cash flow. Okay. Okay. $1,000 is her positive cash flow. So to start the process for Susie, she's going to take $5,000 when she starts it and make it as an additional payment against her mortgage. Then 15th of the month comes through, she'll make her normal mortgage payment. A couple months later, she'll be making a couple smaller withdrawals from the line of credit. So over 12 months, Susie would have paid over $20,000 
as an additional payment to her loan. Well, what does that do for her? She saved $46,000 in interest over the life of the loan in just the first 12 months. Wow. If she keeps doing this, she'll pay off the mortgage 18 years early, saving her $135,000 in interest. And guess how much interest she paid those 12 months off of that $20,000? You're going to tell me, aren't you? 205 bucks. Wow. But you want to remember one thing. Don't try memorizing this. Cash map shows you how. Okay, and, you, and it walks you through. We yeah. got that. I, I, I'm not the best when it comes to these things, so as long as I have something to walk me through, that's, that's great. Right. But again, I, here's devil's the advocate. And here's the risk. risk. You're the risk. You have to <laughs> stick to your budget. Oh, so you have to be disciplined. You've got to be disciplined. Okay, or else don't do this. Otherwise, don't do it. How much is it? $24.95. To download the app. That's right. That's it. That's all. Here's a question I have. Do I ever have to dip into my savings? Absolutely not. Okay, excellent. Very important for me. And does it work for other loans? It works for any kind of loan. Student loan, auto loan, whatever it is, you can use it and apply it to principal. All right. I'm going to look into it. All right. Thank you so much, Dennis. It's a pleasure meeting you. No, it's... <laughs> been a pleasure meeting you. <laughs> and if you want more information on this saving strategy, just check out cashmapapp.com and that's app, A-P-P -P, with two P's.